Hello and welcome to Megash Architecture and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a video in Twinmotion 2023. So to do this you have to actually go into image mode and you can do that here from the bottom corner or the, the just the bottom panel directly you're going to see media just go ahead and select media. I currently have two images selected but we're looking for video. So go over to the video icon here you can see create edit and manage videos just go ahead and click on that. And then what you're going to do next is to find your first frame and your second frame. Those are the two frames that you're going to use to actually create your video. So this is the current or this is currently the first frame. So I'm going to just move this building to one side so you can see this other empty zone. And I'm going to lean the camera like this and try to take that first frame of the video where it's going to start from. And then go ahead and click the plus sign to say add video or adding a new video now. So that's the first frame. Now there are two plus signs possible on Twinmotion. There's one plus here. If you go ahead and click this plus, it's going to create another video. So that's not the one you want to click yet. You have to go down to this second one here and that's right beside and click another frame. So what we're going to do is to move the camera to the second point where we want our video to, let me say, end or continue or just to get the second point in the video. We're just going to pan the camera over, select a good frame point where we want and then go ahead and click this plus sign here to create a second part you can see the duration of the video after video part one where you see the name you can see it here in zero minutes and 10 seconds so that's currently the length of the video now that we have about two frames selected you can go ahead and hit play it's going to start showing you from the first frame moving over to the second frame and there you have your video something that is a cool effect on twin motion that i like so much you can go back to the first frame and change the time of day for this one so currently this is set to 3 p.m in the afternoon i'm going to just switch this all the way down to maybe early in the morning around 5 or 6 a.m yep 6 a.m looks good and we're going to go back to the second frame and change the time of day from 6 a.m to 6 p.m so we're going to see the complete time lapse video so okay that's 8 p.m I think this looks good as well so we're going to leave it at 8 pm so what happens is when you once you're done adding the time you can go ahead and click play as well you can see a quick time lapse video and then you can go ahead and export this it kind of looks nice as well especially if you have a better building than the one i have here so that's basically how you can go ahead creating videos on twin motion once that is done so you can go ahead and rename it here there's three dots in here you can just click this three dots and then go ahead and click rename you can call that twin motion video one whatever name you like to give to it once that's there you can go over to export and then in the video column there's images videos panorama go ahead and select video you can click this icon here that is blue it's normally going to be a plus icon like you see above go ahead and click that we're going to change we're not exporting the first one we're exporting the second one. Oh, i noticed that the name hasn't changed just give me a second okay it's still having video one as the name so we want to actually rename this so you can actually identify it so two in motion video one that's the new name head over to export find the two motion video one that's the only one that was selecting and then once that's done you can scroll down and then hit export and you've got your video save it in your computer and then go ahead for more twin motion and revit tutorials subscribe to the channel i'll see you in the next video